All right, everybody, I'm Shave World. How's it going? I'm going to walk you through a full shave. It's me, David Griffin. I got some things to do, some stuff to change. Got a new item in the den. The uh, Crown King Ipswich Coated Tally Long Rider. It actually is a long rider because it was supposed to get to me about last week. But for some reason, this brush formed a relationship with the driver at the post office and it took another week around. It literally showed up to my post office, then was marked back at the previous destination, then the destination before that, and then it started making its round, rounds back to me. So uh, this brush apparently was highly sought after by the um, mailman. This will be working alongside my Sterling Kong brush. These are both 26 millimeter synthetics here. These have basically murdered all thoughts of a Plasson synthetic. If, you, if you're a Plasson lover, then uh, I don't know what's wrong with you. The Plasson is about 30 bucks or more now, and these come in at a striking $22. I don't, uh, 1995 and $22. This was originally introduced at 1995, but it's about 22 bucks now. Much heavier handle than this one. Uh, they both whip up lather like a dream. Uh, after use, I seem to develop a donut here inside them. I don't know if you can see that. Unused, but I'm going to show you that this one, because we're dealing with the same type of knot, is just as good as this one. It's just how, what kind of feel do you want on your handle. This handle, the Sterling Kong brush, as we affectionately call it, is about a hundred times more substantial feeling than this one, but this one just has a classic feel. This one feels like I'm a man's man, the grooming company brush, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take care of a shave. This one here feels like you want to shave with a, a, a different look to it. You can't go wrong with either. I'm going to show you uh, how we lather this one up and uh, do a palm lather. Then after that, I'll do a video with a full shave on it. Also, new to the den, I've used it three or four times now. The Crown King Prickly Pear Pre-Shave Jelly. It is basically a mentholated touch to your face. It, cools it down and it makes any shave cream you use or shave soap mentholated real good for the skin man um i've used it i can tell you now after the amount of times i've used it it truly 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 cools you off not cold and frozen like the sterling glacial line of stuff but it definitely cools you down it makes any soap mentholated so here goes i'll be lathering it with the crown king sakura sakura Bleu which is an aqua velva type scent I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bloom it heavy you're gonna see this brush work for the first time this is a uh, softer soap more of a croak I don't know if you can get a good look at that I don't want to spill this out yeah I'll spill it softer croak as you can see and uh, first time ever using it You'll check out my other video for full shave using this brush. As you can see, just like a Plasson synthetic, only much more backbone. And I like the feel. This little ridge here, this mid ridge where it's at, where it's curved, is perfect for the fingers. It, like the thumb just slips and fits right in there. Very ergonomic. Very good. You can't go wrong with either brush. This one just feels taller. Than this. You know what? I'll go ahead and lather the face because I'll be rinsing this off for a full shave in a minute. Now, these fibers feel identical. I'll tell you now. Splaying is all awesome, as you can see. With them being the same fiber, the only question is how do you make them feel any different? Well, it all depends. How do you set the knot inside of the uh, handles? And this seems like a shorter handle, which means a little less is set in, and it splays really soft feeling and just bursts out with almost little or no work, as you can see. And it's returning, retaining stiffness, a little bit of stiffness, but not stiff as in bad, but just more backbone. And that's a good thing. Identical to what I feel with the Sterling Kong brush. Now let's see with a little palm lather that I can show you here. Oh wow, excellent. This soap is just from Crown King. It really makes it a impossible to miss mission to lather it. 
you really just got to be a super newbie at wet shaving to not be able to lather with this stuff. And look, look what's happening. All right, let's see. Wow. That's that opalescent, thick, creamy look that I like. Success. So, what we have here is another another testimony of Shave World getting another good product. Good job, Crown King team. The Tally Long Rider. I got the Ipswich. They they also have this Duro Knot. They call it the CK Duro Knot, which is a different actual fiber than this, but it's supposed to have more backbone. But I'm good with this here. This, this is just like the Poisson Synthetic. It snatches soap out of the brush. There goes that donut shape I was telling you about that I do to all my synthetics. But it does a great job. It snatches off the, the lather. I knew it would first time seeing it, but I know that I'm looking at pretty much the same type of knot. I'm not going to lather them back to back like, you know, side by side, half face, half face. That's stupid to me, but that, you, you're getting a great value. Um, you guys get the brush. There's no reason not to. In a short amount of time, if you want a heavier handle, you can get the Sterling Kong brush. You're looking at the same price for just a different handle and brushes. Choices are out there, you guys. Take it easy.